Hello everyone, Rex here from Torch Prep. I'm doing more math videos from the Red Book. So I'm in test three, problem number 36. So what I want you to do is pause this video, read through this question, press play when you're ready to go. Okay, here we are. So what we have here is a shape and inside all the lines that connect inside this pentagon. So they've told us that this pentagon has five lines connecting the points inside. It may look like ten at first, because it looks like each point has two coming off of it. But if you think about it, each line is shared by two points. So really, it looks like two are coming out of each. But really, there's only one, two, three, four, five lines. Because after that, we start re repeating and counting the other side of the same lines. I like to think of this kind of problem as it's really half of what it looks like because all the lines share two corners. But they want to know how many would happen inside of an octagon. So let's just start an experiment and see what we got here. I'm going to start up here. Now, of course, we can't connect two, two corners that are right next to each other. So I'm going to count it off. One, two, three, four and five. Now, just like the Pentagon, we would think, okay, there's five lines coming out of this one, and there's eight sides. Five times eight is 40. I bet the answer is 40, but remember, each of these lines is going to get counted twice from the other side. So if I just keep connecting all of these lines all over, and I counted all of them up, eventually we'll see I'm drawing over the lines that I've already had. I have already been drawing on some of these. And before you know it, I have, I have everything connected from this one except that. This one already has five lines on it. So once again, it's the number we would expect divided by two. So 40 divided by two is 20, which is our letter answer of H. Great job.